I vote. Mm? It's dark. I'm not really good with the dark. Then you should sort out some light. I can't help at the moment. Hmm. Okay. Wah! Ah, a dried up corpse. Its skin is like paper and it it's a box. Got it. Hmm. Something liquid, yeah? I'd love to be able to say it's water, but it stinks horribly. Oh, that's a, a thing. Something metallic. Here's some kind of thick, rough cloth and rubber. No idea what it is. Whoa! G ghosts or or, or, or or something like that. Hmm. Or some kind of cloth. A cape, maybe. No help to me, anyway. Something cold. Made of metal, I think. Like a sphere with round protrusions. Some part of this thing are made of glass, it seems. It's quite heavy, but it's hollow. There's an opening on one side, so it's a kind of container. Hmm, the box is full of little packages. And the packages are full of dried square things. Feels like cubes of dried grass. It smells a bit like it did in sea stone, like sea ocean. It's so familiar. Mm. I know what they are. Dried jelly glowfish. Jelly glowfish are always shipped dried in small boxes. Did you just lick the jelly glowfish? Uh, no. Then how do you know what jelly glowfish taste like? Well, that's my business. I filled the container with that stinky liquid. I'll put the container down here and put a jelly glowfish in it. Uh, Ivo? Yeah? I don't think that was a passage. You don't say. <laughs> Good work. Uh, I think we should get out of here. Fast. Not without us getting what we came for. You mean... Absolutely. The artifact of divine fate. It isn't just being guarded by the monster, it's in the monster. Let's get it. Hmm. Maybe I could use the barrel as a boat, but I'd still need a paddle. I can hardly row with my hands. Now it's my turn! Uh, let's try and think of something else for you. The chest seems to be blocking this hole in the wall. Perhaps it's being sucked in tight. I can't get it out. It's been sucked in tight. A wooden board. It's about a metre long and one end runs to a point.
Here, take it. Thanks. There's no longer room for Ivo in the barrel, but I should be able to reach the other side with dry feet. My dad gave my mum one of those. You put a slate on this round plate and then carefully lower the needle onto the slate. And then you hear the sound of a needle scratching across the slate. Terrible noise, which is then amplified using that pipe there. That thing is too unwieldy for me. I'll only take the scratch loudener. Yeah, That stinks! Like, like, you know, something really bad. I'm not climbing into a hole like that. Somebody else can do that. No, it's okay, Wilbur, you do it. But, um, don't elves have a better sense of direction? You're much smaller than me, so you can squeeze your way through a narrow passage. But I... Get on with it. You want to be a hero, don't you? I would have leapt at the chance if someone had asked me. Ah. Uh... All right. A barrel lid! Oh! A music puzzle! A ghostly apparition in the mirror. I need help. This will help you. A strong rope in good condition. Time to head back. But how? Oh, eh, I get it. And how was it? Ah, uh, the usual. There you are. Thanks. Look what I found, Ivo. Oh, I've got an idea. Crawl into the barrel, will you? Uh, okay. Are you sure this is safe? Oh! Never again. At least we're both on this side now. I'll tie the rope to the handle. Let's try. Okay. that we've done our big friend a big favour with this. A beautifully worked chest. Looks solid. The chest won't be that easy to unlock. We'll need to break it open. Perhaps we could freeze it and... It doesn't always have to be so complicated. I can't get it open. Mm-hmm. 
Looks like a complicated lock. I suggest that we ask Captain Bonnet. Perhaps he can deal with it. I'm sure he can. But first we have to get out of here. There's something else inside. Grandad once woke me up with something like that for a whole week. He had his mind set on making a combat swimmer out of me and yelled at me every morning with it. The cone wouldn't stay there. I can't push it deep enough into the horn. What are you doing there? Maybe I can communicate with the monster. That's never going to work. We're surrounded by tons of flesh and blubber. Yes, but the sound of the horn is amplified, then re-amplified until it's about... Mm, a thousand times as loud in the end. Physical humbug. Obviously. No, I must have eaten something bad. Did you hear that? It can talk. Hello? Who's there? I'm your, um, conscience. That can't be right. I'm a monster without a conscience. Then, hmm, maybe I'm your stomach. My stomach can speak? What do you want? I want to see something of the world too. I want eyes. That won't be so readily possible. And anyway, what is there to see in this cave? The same old walls for thousands of years. You are a thousand years old. You should know that. You were with me down here the whole time, and were grumbling. Who are you really? I'm a god! And what do you want? You should sacrifice something to me! Why should I? Because I am all-knowing and all-powerful. Why should a sacrifice of me mean anything if you're omnipotent? Because, uh, uh, then I will be assured that you really adore me. You're omniscient, you already know. Um, well, um... Who are you really? Me. Who is me? We're too adventurous trapped in your stomach. Really? I'm sorry. Would you let us out? No. I don't get my hands on food very often. But there's no meat on us at all. I was as thin as a toothpick and I weigh less than a sheep. Better than nothing. Come on! We tried that chest from that gap in your stomach. Which chest? The chest that was plugging up the hole. It looked painful. Mm. I don't know what you did, but I'm feeling better than I have in a hundred years. Thank you. So will you let us go? All right then. But perhaps you could lure a few ships here, or a whale or two. Um, 
soon. We'll see. Goodbye. I thought that monster was really nice. Perhaps we really could send a ship or two. You are sometimes so strange. But if we... <gasps> what the... Surprise, my pretty one! But... But... Cap Nate! Have you been working with them all this time? Oh no, my dear. It's just that I happen to know which buttons to press with people like our human friend. What did he promise you? Our lives, mine in particular, and the treasure. All of it, except for one item which he wants to select. I can imagine. Wilbur, don't hand over the artefact of divine fate, understood? Understood. The... The artefact of divine fate. Unlimited power. Go away. I'm... I'm a mighty battle mage. <laughs> sure you are. Nate, you can't allow this to happen. He'll focus on his own affairs. That's what you should have done, too. Uh-uh. You... Ah! Take the artifact to safety. 